Hey, I'm Janice and welcome to Stoffa. If you're new to my channel, I'm all about food and travel. And today we're coming from Edinburgh in the United Kingdom. And the British, they eat lunch. Yeah, who doesn't? Not only the British eat lunch, well, anyway. We found a real British hotspot where they serve British lunch. And um, it's called Clarinda's Clarin Tea Room. I'm having trouble with my words today. It's called I want to go inside and have lunch. Join me. Clarinda's Tea Room is famous for its pies, its shortbread, its scones, but they also serve proper British lunch. And they make everything fresh. And the whole atmosphere is quite nice as well. They have all these little paintings and there's little cups and teas and saucers and whatever. We'll go inside, check it out, but after the lunch, I'm going to show you the cathedral here in, um, in the Royal Mile in Edinburgh, and they have a special secret hidden gem inside the cathedral, which I'm going to show you. So stay tuned for me at the end of the stopper for that, but let's go inside this nice little tea room. So we're inside Clarinda's tea room and it's crowded as always. Um, we ordered a plowman's lunch, which contains sandwiches, crisps, uh, chutney and some cheese or some ham in my case. Um, but we'll start off with a cup of Edinburgh special tea and look what the teapot they gave. Before you want as well. And now it's waiting for lunch. I'm quite hungry, so let's see what this plowman's lunch is all about. You can also get some fresh pies in here and some scones. Scones, of course, are typically a uh, British thing to eat with your tea, but since we're a bit hungry, we're going for the lunch menu. Um, but I'll show you some of the pies that they sell here as well. They're in the back, and I'll make some close ups. <laughs> So I just got my plate and it's filled with all these nice things. Biscuits, bread, ham, apples and of course crisps because the British, they eat crisps for lunch as well. Um, and I like crisps so I'm just going to enjoy my meal and I'll show you a detail of the plate as well so you can see what I'm eating um, and I'll come back to you. So we had a great lunch here at Clarinda's and um, we also bought some caramel shortbread which they made here fresh um, but we didn't eat it now. We got it in our bag. I'm going to show you the special secret thing in the cathedral first and then afterwards when I close off this stuffer I'll eat the shortbread and show you what that's about and tell you how it tastes like. Let's go to the cathedral. Mm -hmm. So we're outside St. Giles Cathedral here in Edinburgh and I told you there is a secret hidden inside this cathedral because it's the only cathedral that has an angel with bagpipes here hidden inside somewhere in a corner and it's made out of wood. Let's go inside, try to find it because it's something not that big and um, it's apparently very special. I've already said that. Well, let's just go inside because I'm repeating myself which is boring. I promised you we would find the angel with the bagpipe. As you can see, they closed the door. I don't know why, but I can't show it to you. That means that the ending of the video that will happen in 10 seconds also doesn't fit because I already pre-recorded that, of course. That's how sometimes how I do it. Um, so, sorry for not showing you the angel. I will find an image and put it in here so you at least have seen the angel. Sorry. We came okay. back the second day because we wanted to show you the chair with the bagpipes. It's up there, it's carved out of wood. I'll zoom in for a close-up later, but I'm happy that I found the chair up so I can show you. So the end of the stuff actually does, um, is okay. So let's go to the end of the stuffer.
Ireland. So we found a little angel with the bagpipes. It's the only church here in Edinburgh, or in Scotland actually, that has an angel with bagpipes in the church. But I promise you as well that we had ordered some shortbread, some caramel shortbread from Clorinda's. They made it themselves and I'm gonna try it and I'm gonna say goodbye. And thanks for watching this stuffer. See you next Sunday in a new stuffer. Maybe it will be Edinburgh, maybe another city, but see you soon. Very good short breath. Mm. Wanna see me stuff more food in my mouth? Subscribe to my channel or watch another stuffer.